All right, check out this little Honda K truck. Got some sporty rims on it. He's got two of them. And I think this is kind of his work truck. And he's got another one he's about to pull out. And he's tricked that sucker out real nice. He says this one has over a million views on his YouTube channel. And I'll be plugging his YouTube channel here in just a minute. We were standing out and uh, <clears throat> checking the mail. He came by and saw us admiring it. Very nice. Very nice. So it's a complete restore then. Yeah, this one was, <clears throat> this is uh, 27 years old. Right. 30,000 right. miles on it. Well, so real quick, what's your YouTube channel? What's your name? That kind of stuff. Uh, my name is Donnie Ray and uh, YouTube channel is uh, K Truck 1997. Nice. So at K Truck, which is K E I. And it's you're a, on TikTok? On TikTok at Donnie Ray also. Um, yeah, man, I redid this one. The seat covers, I did a custom diamond. Do you don't uh, mind? Yeah, no, 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 go ahead, check it out. Everything I've done, I've done an instructional video. Everything that you get comes from Japan on these. You can't right. get anything from right. America here. OEM, I believe they yeah, call it. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I did some ribs, nice. little covers from Japan. Did this put these two together and made it one. This is a Harbor Freight thing, but these nice. the, everything comes with Japanese uh, right, instructions, right. but it has pictures of it. And they make <clears> things very well. They really they are <clears> not <throat> like Americans, man. You know, that's that's into uh the Honda elements in the first place. Like I said, we do the flat toe yeah. with the RVs, delivering them and everything. And uh we start, first started checking out the CRVs. I said, man, that's that's crazy expensive for what we want to do. Anyway, we're both retired, and uh, so anyway, man, th this is this is awesome. I'm about to paint it Tiffany blue to match my Tesla. Yeah, I was looking at that. Yeah. I saw I saw that one the, uh, going somewhere in town here a couple of days ago. I wouldn't doubt it. There, yeah. that one's pretty. <laughs> but yeah, this is a. Uh, I've done probably 40 different things to this thing. Yeah. Already. Very nice. They don't come with like speakers and radios and RPM gauges. And it's a cargo truck. Yeah, yeah no, yeah. it's farmers. Yeah, farmers yeah. use this. Yeah. That was yeah. it. This was, this yeah. is, you either delivered tofu in this thing or you were Hogs. a farmer. They're four wheel drive. <laughs> really? Yeah. yeah. They're, they're now, on. is that on demand like this? Or? Uh, it can be. There's different versions. I actually took my whole drive shaft out. I right. didn't want it four wheel right. drive. I'm not driving in the snow. Yeah. I need better gas mileage and I want to. You know, right. it's a 660cc engine, and it only has 40 horsepower to do 68 miles per hour. It'll go on the highway. I'm not going to take it on the highway, <laughs> but it'll go there. 68 it. miles an hour, that's, that's with it. the windows rolled up. Yeah, yeah, maybe. <laughs> you know, it's about as aerodynamic as a block of cheese. Yeah, I'm so. not doing your tag number here. Yeah, that is such, such a cool, such a cool. I, uh, like I said, we found one in... Uh, it wasn't for sale. The guy had done basically the same thing you did. His was. Well, I'm going to start selling these. I want a yeah. whole dealership of them. Awesome. So awesome. I'm getting, like I said, I'm getting a Subaru Sandbar van. Mm -hmm. Different manufacturers at Toyota, Dahatsu, Honda, um, and Subaru. Mazda Scrim is what they call it, but it's just like a. Scrim, man. I've heard of it. Yeah, so heard all those manufacturers made this truck in Japan. All right, all right. They got a, they got a specific uh, tax credit, kind of like we yeah. do with EVs. Right, the right. The Japanese would. They made these vehicles in the 70s so that small families could get away from driving a motorcycle and could have a sure, family car. Sure, sure. They got good gas mileage and still would get a you'd get a credit from the yeah. government. For driving. Now, what about the uh, electronic ignition stuff? That doesn't have any electronic. Uh, that, so mine is uh, mine's the EFI. They're all carbureted up to 1996. Okay. And so from 96 to on, they stopped making this in 2021. Right. And it still looks almost the same. Yeah, I'll bet. Which is I'll bet. But, yeah. That is awesome. Well, listen, man, it's great vision with you and everything, and uh, I'll be checking out your YouTube channel and yeah. your and your TikTok. talk <laughs> and. Uh, well, awesome. Yeah. And uh, cool. come come check us out. We're uh, I will. Uh, Texoma Honda Elements on YouTube. I will follow you right now. And uh, this you know. thing has been, if it's got a sticker on it, it's been there. I've been to all 48 states driving a truck all, basically all my life. But, uh, uh, you know, we, my I'm wife and I. We don't have a ridge line yet. You know, thought about it, but we we do the overlanding and the camping out in them. We've slept in it. and. Uh, oh, yeah. 
Uh, Wait, well, I had an element for a while. Yeah. I ended up yeah. giving it to one of the pastor's kids at our church. Right, right. Yeah, man, I got it wrecked and just fixed it. You put them that <laughs> That's off a of Toyota, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, the, the theory on that was, I, I wasn't into, you know, Chrome, that the... <clears throat> The brush guard come off a of Ford F-150. Yeah. So I said, I didn't really want that chrome, but I paid 50 bucks for it. I paid $40 for this bumper and yes. welded it direct to the frame. Yeah. And man, if you see That's this, so cool. if you see this element, in fact, one of my nicknames in there is uh, hardest working element that you know. And uh, I, this has always got a trailer hooked up to it. I've hauled huge loads of uh, firewood and you name it, man. I, really? I stay hooked Honda up with it. They make a... They do, but then you still got the plastic back bumper, and it the uh, <coughs> the hitch actually rides lower, so people have a hard time with the uh, uh, you know dragging the hitch, and you're already that low. So if you get a heavy load on there, then and Ellie Grace is my wife. She's got a black one. She's got an 06. This is 04. So there it is. Yeah, Cody yeah. Jackson. That's me. All right. Yeah. All right, man. Hey, thanks for visiting with me, and uh, thanks for your time.